earthquakes, floods. The economy collapsed because of all those natural disasters. But a lot of the blame went to mutants, Homo superior. Some call them the next stage in human evolution. Others, a threat to our very existence. So now we've got these purifier cults springing up everywhere. They say they're humanity saviors. Well, someone's got to do it. We X-Men will work with local and national authorities to keep the peace and to deliver help where it's needed. And the Brotherhood of Mutants will protect its own. One man could have brought sense and sanity out of this chaos, but Charles Xavier is dead. Struck down when he and Magneto faced the menace called Bastion. The Professor's dream died on that day. Without him, the X-Men just fell apart. But Mr. Summers, what about the school? Right here, right now, the school is just a target, Pixie. We'll rebuild it somewhere else. The government's Mutant Response Division has deployed 10,000 troops in the Bay Area and moved its Telos Com satellite into orbit above the city. Commander Reyes, do you think the MRD presence here will diffuse the tension, restore some kind of normalcy to the city? That's our all. What about Magneto? Magneto has not been seen since the Bastion incident. Everyone lists Magneto among the missing, but he's still out there. He's just deciding on his next move. Between mutants and purifiers, San Francisco is a virtual powder keg. What will it take to bring calm? Who will be the voice of reason?